Okay, so I put the motor on the bike frame to see if it fits. I was expecting the axle to be longer and I was expecting to to be needed to widen the frame a little bit but I see it's alright quite close the bad thing is that the the disc won't line with the brake I think I need to to angle grind here a little bit to to move the brake a little on the on the right so the disc will line with the brake now I'll take the disc and put it on the motor then put the motor with the disc back on the frame and see how am I going to to fit it so I put the disc no need to grind everything comes easily because the original bike wheel had 32 spokes and the motor had 36 I had to buy a new 26 inch bike wheel with 36 spokes now comes the hard part which is the wheel building also known as lacing I decided to use the spokes that came with the wheel I had Sabine here to help me with the wheel as he's better than me when it comes to bikes I'll fast forward this part to save some time as I don't want this to be such a long video basically we start by putting all of the spokes into the hub starting from outside so the head of the spoke will be outside the flange then connecting them to the rim unlocking them with the nippers we start connecting the spokes from one side leaving one empty space on the rim after each spoke for the ones from the opposite side then we rotate the motor until the spokes look uh, tensioned then we flipped the wheel to connect the spokes from the other side we connected one spoke facing the opposite direction to the spokes already connected from the other side until the spoke looked tensioned then we locked the spoke in the ring with a nipple and so on Unfortunately, the battery died and the recording stopped. Here, Sabine was tightening the spokes with a spoke wrench. So, as you can see, the wheel still needs some adjusting, but we'll take care of that later. As I mentioned in the first part, um, I bought this motor for 20 pounds but I don't know yet if it works or not so I decided to wire it to the hoverboard controller to test it. Thank you for watching, don't forget to share it with your friends and stay tuned.